Hello my friends, <coughs> sorry for not making any videos uh, for the last, uh, what is it, 2-3 weeks. But uh, I had a heart uh, surgery and uh, after that my uh, neck uh, is uh, starting to collapse so it gives me more or less a constant uh, headache. So uh, f now, first I feel I can uh, start making videos again. At least uh, I hope I will be able to continue to do so. So uh, <coughs> in uh, this video, I will use well, X radar chrony. My uh, <coughs> pistol Umarex TP50 compact. This is the 11 year version. It says so on the box. And uh, that is just about right. I will not power tune it because it has a very crappy detent uh, seal so uh, it still has the restrictor in place and I will not remove it Ooh, that won't sat tight Shot the uh, Allen key, hex wrench. Just loosening it. It has been sitting for uh, a few months. As you can see, the restrictor is down there. Not sure if it is visible. When I got the tuning barrel from Floria, I put it in. So, uh, trying to not make as much noise uh, as uh, possible because of my grumpy neighbors, I will use a silencer. Also from Home Defense 24. I have uh, modified the silencer uh, somewhat, so uh, I'm not going to fill with uh, putting that on, on the camera. Uh, so the silencer has some baffles now, not just a big foam thing. So if you check out uh, some other videos about it, then you see how I did it. Uh, ammo I'm going to use today is coated steel balls. What is it? <coughs> Five gram. And I thought, okay, uh, why not try the killer arrow? Maybe I try these first. Where I screw on the silencer. These are quite uh, short, uh, stubby things. Fit quite loose in the barrel. You know what? I think I just dropped them down by uh, gravity because they have a very good uh, clearance. Yeah, you can see the tip of it uh, there. So, uh, I'm curious to see the weight. I don't remember the weight of these uh, killer arrows. 
Let me see just quickly. Check, check the weight. So let's see the weight on this thing. Is as gently as possible. 110.6 grains. I think that is uh, just about 7 grams or so. Yeah. So, uh, one moment. And I load up. And uh, then we can see what sort of corner numbers we get. So my friends, so maybe it's better if I keep it a bit back, like so. Temperature is uh, about 22 degrees Celsius. And so, uh, the warmest of days. Last time I was shooting it was 25 degrees, but uh, it's been colder now, so it's 22. So, let's see. I use this brand CO2 canister. It's the only one I can find here in Norway. So, uh, let's try. Will it hold gas? Sure does. Pop it out there. Looks super cool with a silencer. James Bond shooting from the hip. <laughs> so let's see. I forgot the crown. Me one moment. Here it is. Okay, let's try uh, muscle loading. What is this? Uh, Killer darts, he calls it. Boop, drop it straight down. 110 grains. So let's see. I have four layers of greens I'm shooting into. I think that should be enough. It started sliding out uh, the barrel, so it wouldn't read. So uh, let's try something different. Let's do like this. It should be able to give us a chrono number. Below 100 feet per second, zero, 00, no point in uh, trying it. Much of the blast was downwards, as you can see. So, uh, don't think uh, I will try these anymore. Mm, there it is. Too heavy. For that uh, tiny pistol. Let's, uh, let's add the coated uh, steel balls, 5 gram. So let's see. Five ground balls. Mm, 
again you pop it down Two hundred and eleven. Not exactly screaming fast, but uh, after all, it's uh, only an uh, eleven-year version. One eighty eight, one ninety two. One seventy two. Let me do a little reload and uh, try again. Didn't read, that was odd. Let's try again. One sixty five. One fifty six. This uh, pistol is a strange marker for sure. One thirty nine. So, uh, yeah, too bad. Uh, didn't get any chrono numbers from uh, these uh, arrows. So, uh, yeah, well, it looks kind of cool, but it's a super crappy design. The Tiggy Guard blows down every time, and uh, that's because uh, this blow by in the rear here. So, uh, and the blow by is because of the bad detent. Hope someone will 3D print uh, a detent one day. So, uh, yes, 
just wanted to make a video for you guys uh, since I haven't made any for quite some time and I thought okay uh, one video is better than no video so uh, I have all the videos planned about both the Stormer and the HDR50 and uh, I'm going to order the new HDR50 version 2 that has the upgraded uh, CO2 tube and a new uh, puncturing uh, screw so uh, stay tuned for more videos so uh, I will feel uh, or I'm feeling a little bit better each day so I hope uh, I can start up again uh, normally next week I hope so, but if you don't see me make any videos, then uh, you know my health issues. I also have uh, a family, so I cannot uh, make videos uh, anytime I want. I need to be alone at home when I'm going to make videos. Yes. So, uh, for tuning parts, etc and ammo check out uh, Florian Cerner's website homedefense24.com so uh, here's the super cute uh, small 8 gram CO2 canisters <laughs> okay hope you liked the video see you again another time and thank you for watching